Meet Mark Schauer. He's a Democrat and is challenging Michigan Republican Governor Rick Snyder this fall. Schauer grew up in Howell and had what he describes as a classic middle-class upbringing. His dad was a high school science teacher, his mom was a nurse, and his extended family was always close by. You wouldn't know it from looking at him now, but as a kid, Schauer was an offensive lineman on his high school football team and played catcher in baseball. Husky was the term they used back then, he said. Schauer graduated from Albion College, where he was enrolled in the Gerald R. Ford Institute for Public Policy, and he later earned advanced degrees at Western Michigan and Michigan State University. He lives with his wife Christine in Battle Creek. He has three stepkids, four grandchildren, and two big dogs. Schauer was first appointed to the Battle Creek City Commission in 1995, launching a political career that spanned nearly 20 years. He served in the state legislature from 1997 through 2009, including a run as Senate Democratic Minority Leader under former Governor Jennifer Granholm. In 2008, Schauer defeated incumbent Republican Rep Tim Wahlberg for a seat in the U.S. House, where he voted for some major legislation, including the Affordable Care Act. Wahlberg repaid the favor two years later, knocking Schauer out after just one term in Washington, D.C. Schauer has vowed to be Michigan's education governor if elected, and he says one of his first tasks would be trying to repeal the so-called pension tax that Snyder approved in 2011. Remember to vote November 4th and come back to MLive for complete coverage and analysis of elections across Michigan.